Hi, I'm Skyler. If you've just gotten a new iPhone and you've got the old one with you and you're wondering, oh man, how am I gonna get the photos from the old one to the new one? Mm -hmm. Well, if you have a Mac, you could use iPhoto and iTunes. But if you don't have a Mac, and well, worse yet, if you don't have a computer, then it seems like a really challenging problem. But there's a really simple app that's totally free, which will allow you to do it. Go to the App Store on your old phone and download Dropbox. Once you've downloaded Dropbox, just create an account and one of the first things it asks you will be, do you want to upload all your pictures? We'll give you five gigabytes of space in order to do that. And five gigabytes of space is actually a, a, a lot when you think of photos and videos. Um, I think right now on my phone, I've got something like 1500 photographs and uh, around 60 videos. And I believe that's around 5.43 gigabytes. So I wouldn't quite make it, but I'd get really, really close. Now, let's say you already have Dropbox installed on your phone and you actually didn't elect to upload your images when it offered it. Well, let's take a look at the phone and the Dropbox app and see how we could turn that on. So I tap Dropbox and then right down here at the bottom actually is what looks like a picture. So if I tap that, uh, there we go. I could just tap Enable Camera Upload and ta-da, they'd give me more space and then start uploading all my images. Now on my new phone, I'd just download Dropbox, sign in, and I'd have access to all of the pictures that have been uploaded to Dropbox. Now, if I wanted to save them onto my camera roll, it would be a slightly different process. You know, I'd have to uh, select the image and then actually save it to the camera roll. So to move things onto your phone, your new one from Dropbox could be a laborious process, but it might not actually be what you want. Either way you go, at least now you know one more option. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.